Hey guys, welcome back to another video here at Creators Theory. In today's video, we'll see how to improve your video quality using SpeedRamp. But before starting this tutorial, if you don't have the latest version of Filmora, then make sure you download it from the link in the description below. And if you're new to this channel, then make sure hit the subscribe button and follow for more amazing tutorials. Now let's get started. So let's get started. As you can see, I'm in Filmora right now and I've already imported the media that I want to uh, do a speed ramping on. So let me just bring this media into the timeline. So this uh, video that I have is uh, shot at 120 f majorly more than 60 fps for slow motion video. So if I uh, let me just play this video and see how the original video looks. So you also can get the idea how the original video looks like. So. As you can see, it is uh, a slow motion video and uh, kind of slow motion and that means it's uh, it has been uh, uh, shot at a much higher frame rate. So what I will do, I will just uh, click over here and then uh, here you can see there is a, a speed option over here and here we will see speed ramping. And here there are multiple custom options to go about and uh, for most of this uh, speed ramping that we do, uh, these are the best options that we can go about. For this video, we can we will go about and have a look at two of the few speed ramps. So first one we will have a look at is at the bullet time over here. So once I click it, click at it, uh, click at it, it will automatically get added to this video. Now let's just play the video and see how it goes. So as you can see, initially the video is quite. Uh, fast so it is not at the original speed that it was shot at so as you can see it, it is at 5x so i think it is quite far more fast than the original video it had been so what i will do i will just try to decrease it to 4 maybe speed of 4 i'll keep the slow speed as it is but i will decrease the normal speed to 4 both the sides as you can see and now let's uh, play the video and see how it goes So as you can see there is a normal video and then the video slows down and you can see the flap of the bird and then again this video fasts up so that gives a speed ramp effect where there is a little more dramatic effect to the video. So this is one of the custom, uh, custom uh, pre-made template for uh, speed ramp. The another one is a hero moment template. So again this uh, let's just play the video again and see how it looks. Uh, just click on it and it will automatically get applied to the video that you have selected. So just play. So here what happens is it takes the video normally which is uh, 1x which is a normal speed which is slow and then it speeds up to 5x and then it slows down completely to around 0.5x and then again speeds up and again slows. So it is a little bit distorting. So if what we can do we will go this to 4x. We'll keep the initial speed as 4x over here, both the side. Uh, so I don't want that initial slow speed, but I want more of a fast speed and then increase the speed to 5x and then decrease it. So this will give me an amazing uh, effect. Uh, let's just do and see that. So as you can see, I have uh, both the sides have made it 4x and at the uh, middle over here, this keyframe is around 5x and these below are again for uh, 0.5. Now let's just bring the player at the start and see. So this gives an amazing curve of speed ramps uh, for your video. So these these are the one of the type uh, one of the ways you can use a speed ramp. You can also use speed ramp. Uh, you here you can see flash in and flash out. So you can use this flash in and flash out for transitions from fast to slow another fast video and transition that video to another video. So this will be a part for another video. If you want to see a speed ramp transition, then mention it in the comment section below. So that's it guys with this amazing speed ramp tutorial. I hope you guys like this video. If you guys like this video, then give this video a thumbs up. And if you want to see more videos like this, then make sure to hit the subscribe button. See you guys in another video. Till then, see ya.